Climate change has spared no region. Dry weather, heat waves, all this has impacted every sector. Now, Iraq's Kurdish region is no different. Walnut farmers are struggling with the scarcity of water. Let's take a look. Dry seasons and water scarcity have taken a toll on the walnut production in Iraq's Kurdish regions. The walnut yields in the areas of Havraman, Tawela and Biara in Sulaymaniyah Governorate has seen a sharp drop. This year, because of drought and lack of water, walnut production drastically declined. And it is very bad compared to previous years. The harvest was delayed. In fact, some farmers left it to decompose and fall down with the rains. The main trade in this region is to shake walnut or mulberry trees. But we are mostly famous as walnut tree shakers because it covers people's living expenses in a region where walnut harvesting is one of the most important jobs some farmers have decided to delay the harvest because of the low yield while others felt that it would be pointless to harvest the stone fruit at all this is Hauraman, which is between iraq and iran the other side of the canal is iran and this side is Iraq. I am a walnut shaker. This area doesn't have as many walnuts as it used to be in the past. The walnut production has declined. It has been damaged by the heat and the lack of water. Harvesting walnuts is a labor-intensive task, as workers on farms have to climb up trees and shake them until the fresh walnuts drop to the ground. The harvesting season begins in October and ends in November, depending on the area and the weather conditions. Sarhad Osman sells walnuts at a shop in Havraman and says the locally grown nuts are superior to imported varieties. It is good quality walnut with a very nice and thin shell. It is not like the walnuts from other countries, which taste bad. Havraman is home to some 85,000 walnut trees whose branches peek into the sky, painting a picturesque scene in the mountainous region's forested areas. After collecting the nuts, villagers peel them before taking them to shops that sell them. A bag filled with a thousand walnuts is roughly worth $50. With varying climatic conditions, the walnut farmers of this region are looking at a bleak future.